All right, mate. We're gonna go right over here. We're gonna <laughs> fucking You're, take you see, this shit. You seem a lot hard, right? You sound like the Beatles. <laughs> Cause we are the Beatles. We, us four, we're the Beatles. Yeah. Have a new mantra. Mm, Paul's a big fat cunt. <laughs> I don't know why, but my favorite yeah. line. Boom, Ooh, baby. Visceral. Oh yeah, that shit's cool. That was awesome. My favorite line of that scene is when Jack Black goes, "Of course I remember. I'm the leader of the Beatles." Yeah. <laughs> Fucking love so it. fucking stupid. Yeah. <laughs> who uh, who the fuck plays Ringo? I always forget that. Oh, J uh, it's Jason Schwartzman. Oh yeah. He's in like Judd Apatow movies. Yeah. He's, not that funny. he's in Scott Pilgrim vs. the World, right? Yeah. yeah. He's um. He's like uh, Gideon, I think. Yeah, he is. Yeah. He's also he's in Funny People as like a super depressing dude. Believe it. Ow. Bitch. Oh god. Uh, oh god. Dogs. Oh god. There's so many. Jesus. I'm scared. Oh baby. Oh Jesus. You have a stamina bar. Oh god. Oh, I'm dead. Yep. <laughs> Guys, so, chill. It's over. So, you I'm kinda, got, they're like, eating your flesh, bro. They're hungry. I guess I'll like kind of start giving you the lowdown on what's happening here. What? So, is beat. Oh, whack. We can fix it with the power of technology. Um, fix so you're in Yarnum. Technology. I would say, say this is basically do the thing Dark, Dark Souls, Souls if, if Bioshock, Bioshock happened. It's okay, very so similar to Bioshock. We should make Alex play Bioshock. Ooh. That would be fun. We've been We're talking, talking about, about Bioshock a lot, yeah, because we the past two games were like, yeah, this is like Bioshock. Well, I would say story-wise, this yeah. is like Bioshock. Basically, um, this town, like, like I said, you transfuse yourself with blood. It's like magic blood. And so, the reason all these people are like... Oh, you see that? Like, you see that parry? That wasn't a parry. A, you, super a parry is, is a visceral attack. Uh, they they stagger when you do it, right? Um, so, they learned how to use this blood that just makes you just feel better, stronger, like it cures diseases. But as people started using it more and more, kind of like plasmids, like it started. They got crack headed out to it. They got crack headed out. And whereas that turned you into splicers, this steadily turns you into a beast. Come on, man. Put that shield down, you punk ass. And, like, I'll the blood comes from, like, I'll some take you weird... Out. Let's go. Like, Elder Is this your God plan? You're just gonna block? The blood comes from, like, yeah, a weird unknown source. Yeah. Come on. Just... What? Come on. Oh, the shield to, guy. Trying to dole the story out in, like... That's, that's quite weird. That guy didn't attack me at all. It's another thing I like about I love about this game. If you don't give a shit about the story, you're gonna just be like, eh, you're like, kill a monster. Yeah, like I can fight a monster. And I feel like that is a style. I feel like a hunter actually would do that. I'm just like, I don't give a shit what's going on in here to just kill monsters. That's why the DLC happens. I believe the device is right there, right next to you, right there. This one? Yeah. Nope. To your left. The lever. The ah. lid. The lid. The lid. I'm just going a, a different ass. Yo, way go this fight time. that troll. I don't want to fight that troll. Go fight, fight that troll. He's, he frightens me. I'd rather and ladies this and gentlemen, we have shortcut number one unlocked. Ow. Yo, light that whole boardwalk on fire. You've been here. I have. What's your right? Oh yeah. No, no, don't go up, you've just been there. <laughs> Alright, so you really want to test, like, kill that guy. That's how you learn parrying. Okay. He's got a big ass knife. Let's go, bitch. This thing is in my way. There we go. Uh, it's also your chance to farm some blood vials. Oh god. Just shoot him when he starts attacking. 
Oh. Ooh. Yeah, it's a lot of damage, but you don't have that many blood vials or blood echoes. I'm gonna use one. Ooh, you could have gotten a pretty good um. Oh. Oh. Try and shoot. You yeah. getting? Ooh. Up. Oh, I didn't mean to get this close. Oh, oh grabby. <laughs> Damn. This is hard. <laughs> you don't say. Seems like it. It is. Like I said, it's the same dudes in the same spots doing the same moves every time. Once you get used to it, because easy shit. I'm trying. I'm trying to do it with the, the more aggressive blade. See how that works for me. Like, like I this said, this fucking it's just... guy again. Come here. People. Pe uh, it's... Oh. Oh. Uh, fun, fun fact. Back. Also, I believe so, yeah. visceral attacks fully heal for your bar. Oh, that's cool. Not not, not full health, but like um. You know, in like fighters, fighters, you had that blue bar. It's like yeah. A... It, it just immediately heals the blue bar. Yeah. Except Come it's here. an Come orange here. bar. Bob. That, that did a lot of damage. Uh, you can you get, get, get the shield. shield. You can As break his shields. How? Just, just attack the shit out of him. Mm. No, just you can keep going. You, you can, can also, also pick, pick it up, up as a weapon, but it's like... Yeah? It's kind yeah, of just, just a joke. joke. There... It's... it's so... so all the weapons in this game are just like from a specific spot, right? Yeah. It's just like, okay, here's the one. You're up. Don't got no item! No! I have no Molotov cocktails. Gonna have to Yeah, because you threw them all in like the first 10 seconds of you getting them. They were burning a hole in my pocket. No. What do you want? As they should. Oh, I'm wearing like my Kevlar, Kevlar hunting pants. pants. What would you do if a man came into your house? In Kevlar hunting pants? <laughs> no, in the scuba gear. In scuba gear. And said, I come to reap your family. I'd let him in. Like, <laughs> you now know you've been transported to like a Mortal Kombat map or something. You're like, oh. <laughs> We gotta fight this guy. Looks like oh, I'm the new scuba, scuba character. character. I yeah. forgot, he, forgot they added him to the roster. Scuba yeah. Steve. <laughs> You're like, it's a custom character. Like, time to fight. Let's go. Is this guy just. Oh, you no, hear the Guile theme out. in the background. Guile theme. Yeah, da 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 this guy I think goes with anything. Oh yeah, pretty great. Did you ever see the video Ocean Man ends every movie perfectly? <laughs> no, but I can believe it. I can totally believe that. I love that song. It's a great video. Uh, they play the song too long every time though, which yeah. kind of ruins it. But like, you ever you've seen the end of like The Graduate, right? Yeah. Where, like, Hello, darkness, my old yeah. friend. Yeah. It's just them sitting, and then it goes. <laughs> Ocean man, take me by the hand, take me to the land. I love that. That, that song's perfect. Uh, yep. Motherfucker. I feel like Ocean Man would go well to this. Every time die. Yeah. Hey, mod community. Yeah. Here's an idea for you. Ocean Man? Er, I'm sorry. Bloodborne. <laughs> Except every time you die, it plays the entirety of Ocean Man. Yeah. You can't skip it either. <laughs> you have to listen to the whole song before you respawn. Fuck playing with bongos. Try having a game over screen that lasts like five minutes long. Yeah, and it's just Ocean Man. You ever play yeah, Enter the Gungeon? Yeah, that's optimistic about it. What? You ever play Enter the Gungeon? I've played a little bit of it through like a share play. So I have so, like no basis of the game, but I know like the gameplay of it. It's Binding of Isaac-ish, 
the literal thing that keeps me from playing it more often is the fact that the game over screen takes like 0.2 seconds too long. Oh, really? Like, it's just long enough that you feel like you're waiting. Uh, in a game that like dying is a big piece of yeah so you're constantly just like oh that's whack like it doesn't it takes a really long time it takes a really long time for it to like get on your nerves but once it does you're like oh my god point point three seconds shorter please you know what i like uh monster hunter has a really good respawn time you get hit and they're just like all right asshole get back in there that game's so fucking hard it is, dude. I still gotta. I'm still stuck on that bit with the uh, the Raffian trail or whatever. Have you killed like the first one or? I've killed my first Raffian, but now okay. I'm on the bit where you have to find like the evil Raffian tracks. Oh, okay. Ooh, yeah, that shit's gonna be rough. It's cause like you just go into the world and find the tracks. Fuck that. Yeah. No, that shit takes forever. So what you gotta do is just do hunts. Put in Put in the time. Yeah, do hunts, fucking find some shit. I, I have some, like, six-star ones unlocked, and I'm kind of afraid to do them. I'll be out with them. I need, I need fucking uh, materials, dude. I actually just re-downloaded it. Hey. Yeah. I was, uh, I was using my fucking... Did you ever fight the weird wolf monster things? In, like, the, the poison town? Yeah. Yeah. I have, a uh, fucking... Ow, there's people behind me, too? Oh, yeah, what the know. fuck? Oh, you're rude. You get the fuck out of my face, sir. Get uh, out of here I would... this nonsense. So, I would honestly say this game is very forgiving. Because the enemies have, nice. like, an aggro distance. Yeah. Like sometimes can... though, I feel like they do just chase you. No, they definitely chase well, you. Well, no, just some... trying to like get them a little spread out. Some of them chase you for a long time, but like if you run away, like they'll always kind of like calm their shit. Yeah. Which I respect, because they could just be like, but like, even fucking Mega Man doesn't have that. Yeah. No, that shit's gonna follow you.